Employee development and coaching is about transformation. It's about leaders transforming their direct reports in four ways. The first is transform their knowledge into actionable skill. The second is transforming their general outlook into full commitment for the culture. The third is taking their experiences, adding more, and transforming those into wisdom. And the fourth is helping them smooth out their rough spots in their temperament. It's a continuous improvement process, and it takes considerable time and effort on all parties involved. It's also about accountability. On the one hand, leaders must have the authority to hold their direct reports accountable for efforts to improve. On the other hand, leaders themselves must be held accountable for adding value to that work. Employee development and coaching is critical because the company can only grow as fast as the growth rate of their people. Leaders who excel at development and coaching, first and foremost, must be personally accountable to the process. They seem to be able to evaluate very, very accurately where their people are. And then they bring their organizing skills and their goal orientation to bear on the process. One of the things that's not really talked about that much is they must be somewhat futuristic thinkers. Not only do they have to know where the employee is, they have to know where they're going and how far they will need to go. When it comes to employee development, there's always room to improve. It's not about where you are, but where you're trying to go as a coach. My mother used to say that human development is about education and dedication. And that's exactly what good leaders do. They focus on those two things. That said, think about what great teachers you've had, what great coaches you've had, and what previous bosses you've had. What was it that they did, and how often do they do it, to develop you, to educate you? In turn, what were the lessons that you took away from that? Based on that and that, their role modeling, what can you do then to work with your direct reports so they can gain the same kind of wisdom as you?